Hello. Today I'd like to demo a new feature that we've added to RuneStone and it's called Dynamic Questions. So the idea is that you might want to make a quiz and you might want to have uh, several different options for each question that are presented to your students, essentially so that students will see uh, a different quiz with questions selected from a question bank. So to demonstrate that, uh, I've got a page where we've got a, a little timed assessment set up. Um, on the left here, we've got student Hogwarts 1. On the right over here, we have myself. So let's click the Start button for the quiz and see what questions we have. So over here on the left, we've got a multiple choice question for student 1 to fill in the blanks. We've got a uh, random selection question here to fix, to choose the numbers that are less than three. We've got a coding question here, and we've got a Parsons problem here. Let's see what questions we have for student number two. We click the start button. We got the same question here. We got a different multiple choice got the same coding question, and a different Parsons problem. All right, so you, we can see that the selections that we're making are different. Let's go ahead and uh, just answer these questions. Now, if we refresh the page, we'll see that the student is going to see their previous answers to the questions. Okay, so let's take a look at the source. So here's how we created this quiz. So we created a, a timed exam here. Uh, we added a fill in the blank. All right, that's the normal way. So uh, everybody's going to see that exact same question. We did then did a select question, and this is the new directive that we've added. So this says uh, pick one of these three questions at random to display to the user. Here was the coding question. Uh, we only gave one choice there, so every student saw that. And then down here for the Parsons problems, we had three different random uh, options to choose from for that Parsons problem. So that got built into what you saw here. 